at my channel. Today I wanted to do a real quick embellishment share. I am not going to make them on camera, but I will explain to you how I made them and what I used. So today I made them with The Love Story by Lori Whitlock and this paper pad. I picked it up at um, Tuesday morning. Sorry, I kind of blanked out. I picked it up at Tuesday morning and it comes with all these you know the stickers and stuff and the cut apart and really awesome little you know papers and details and stuff and I liked this versus um there's a different one that they had at Tuesday morning and it's like it has a a um Eiffel Tower on it and I didn't really like that one I liked these cutesy little stickers so I wanted to do that this is so yeah, this is a paper pad I used, and it has, like I said, all the cut up cutouts. I used this sheet right here, and I cut out these Polaroids, and I used the sticker sheet that came with it. As you can see, it's kind of empty. I used a couple of big ones as well for different projects, but I wanted to share with you what I made. These are all the cut aparts, Polaroids that I used. I only used some of them and I wanted to see how they turned out and I really liked how they ended up looking. So let's start with this one. This is a little embellishment that I created for a bunch of ladies using, using a digital stamp from Saturated Canary and I have a whole roll of tickets and I just stamped February 14 and on top of that I stopped a stamped a love this stamp using this stamp it almost looks like it's I, I got it at Tuesday morning and I can't for the life of me I want to say it's Maggie Holmes I'm not sure but yeah, this is what I used. And a little rosette and some thread in the back. I need to kind of hide this one. And a stick, a um, arrow sticker. So that's that one. <clears throat> Excuse me. Here's another one using the same stickers and some puffy hearts that were from the Target Dollar Spot. Some flat back pearls more stickers in the back over here and this was actually a label the little it's like a metal label the little hole where you attach it to the ring is on behind the heart little flagged stickers and again thread all these I love using thread thank you to Ara the paper treasury she's the one that kind of got me into you know doing doing that and I've picked up a couple of different metallic and pretty colored ones at my thrift then there's this one this is a chipboard piece from the target chipboard that usually come around this time it's in the little book and it's like $4.99 that's that this is a little wood piece and I painted it with nail polish some more stickers target dollar spot washi tape and the thread this sticker this one this one are from the collection and this little circle label is one that out of the paper treasury actually sent me and then this one is more labels from Ada all the stickers and these ones actually have sentiments on it I think that's one of the things that really kind of hindered me from creativity when Ada shows on her channel I'll link her on the bottom when she makes embellishments is that she covers up certain things and that was really hard for me to not cover up a cute sticker and with this collection and this time around I was like you know what I'm just gonna throw that out the window and just kind of put things together without thought without really um, thinking too much about what the sentiment said and I can tell you that has opened up so much more for me and I'm thinking that I really like it. Thank you, Ara. That is, your video is very inspiring. All of your videos are inspiring. But to think outside of the box of just that one cute sticker 
to use it on that one thing, but if it gets covered up, it won't look cute. No, that's not true. It will look amazing. Another one, another sticker in the back with, it has words on it as well. Threw that out the window and just gonna go with it. A punched out circle from the collection. More washi, heart glitter washi from the Target dollar spot. Thread and sticker from the, um, the collection. Last but not least, oh, this one's upside down. This one is another Polaroid and I layered some crepe paper on the bottom. This ribbon rose on top. Some of this gold leaf kind of trim from, from Hobby Lobby. Everybody's kind of gotten it so far. I mean, it's in the trim section, so you can't miss it. There's like pink ones and black ones and all types of colors. More flowers from the collection. And yeah, that's it. That is my little um, share for today. I didn't have too much, but I really wanted to show you guys. And I'm so proud because I've done kind of what Ada uses in her videos. And, you know, it's a cute sticker, but really am I going to use that one sticker for its sentiment? Probably not. And a lot of my stickers, I hoard them because I don't want to cover up the sentiment. And I can't tell you how much that's opened up my eyes into the possibilities of what could be instead of just hoarding it because of the sentiment. Thank you for stopping by. And you know what? Go check out Ada's channel if you haven't. She's a paper treasury. I will link her at the bottom so you guys can take a look at her amazing embellishments. Her Instagram is so colorful. I love it. She's a funny gal. I love that chica. And shout out to her. And thank you because you've inspired so much. And if you haven't seen her cake video, I love that video and that is going to be my next thing that I'm going to try out and I'm going to use all the scraps from all these this collection so Valentine's cakes coming up. Yes. Thank you and I hope you enjoyed a simple share. Bye guys.